What's up, Pandus? Peter Von Panda here. I just bought myself this Intex inflatable air mattress. And you may have these uh, inflatable air mattresses for all sorts of reasons. Camping, guests, you know, uh, a little bit of extra uh, sleeping area when you have a buddy crashing or something like that. Uh, whatever your use may be, they are really very uh, useful and handy to have around. But the one thing that I hate about them is that you either need to usually have the ones with an electric pump built in so that you can inflate them, or you have to have your own pump, like a foot pump or an air pump or an electric pump, or you're gonna be blowing into the air mattress. And it's not a bad one, it's a camping mattress and it's really thin, but when they're big like this and in, in, in thick and fluffy that's a lot of air moving through your lungs and you're gonna get winded you're gonna get lightheaded etc etc so the interesting thing about this is that this twin sized mattress has a built-in pump for easy inflation so you kind of step on it I'm actually not sure how it works but I assume it's maybe spring-loaded to uh, rebound after you push it down you push down and press air in and then there's probably a couple of valves that the spring will uh, expand that pump area back out and you press it down again. I'm not entirely sure. Let's go ahead and unpack it and see if it works and is worth the darn. All right, guys, so I have the Intec air mattress uh, spread out here. And um, the interesting thing about it is on the back side, or actually what will be the top side, I think maybe, is there is a little bit of this microfiber, kind of like that fake suede material. Um, I'm actually not entirely sure which side is up or down at the moment but there is this kind of uh, hard rubberized plastic material on this side very much like a the bottom of a tent and there are two valves and this is the pump and you can see it's kind of large because it's under pressure it's uh spring loaded or something which is how that's going to work and then there is an other another valve right here and this is for deflating it or filling it with an external pump so what you want to do is because you're not gonna use an external pump because I'm gonna use it with the foot pump, there's actually two valves here. There's kind of this outer valve, which I'll pull out if I can. Oops, I pulled out the whole thing. So there's, there's really two and valves. This is the one you want this plugged in and this one pulled out if you're going to use an external pump to pump this up. Now to deflate the mattress, you're gonna pull out the whole valve assembly itself. And this is just letting air out. I filled it a little bit and I can feel the air rushing out. So that's how you're going to deflate this little bad boy once you're done with it. Otherwise, you're gonna plug these in here and it's pretty tight, but I guess I, I'd feel better if there were like a click or something to, to make sure that once it's filled up and you've got someone laying on it that it's not gonna pop this bad boy out and go All right. So to fill it up, you want to make sure that these two valves are, are plugged up tight. And then come over here to the pump and remove this cap. There's a plastic cap which holds it down. And then a little like rubber stopper in there. And that's creating an a airtight seal. Now, as I mentioned, there's like a spring. And it's probably spring or, you know, a plastic bottle or tube or something that's providing resistance here. And that is probably, you know, six or seven inches high. Um, so you, you use this to pump it. Now the key to getting this thing full is that you want to pump it with your foot. And your foot, you actually may want to have your shoe off. It may work with a shoe. But what I've noticed is that once it fills up and comes to the top here, you kind of want to cover the hole as best you can with your foot and push down. And that's going to capture the air inside. Because if I just push here, it's just pushing the air right back out of that hole. So you want to trap that air, kind of like milking a cow, and push it down. You, you know, and every time you're going to let up, you're probably going to um, have to give it a second to refill. And then you want to capture that air. And as you can see, what we're doing is we're getting air into the, into the mattress. Now, it's not filling up super quickly, but it is filling up and it's... Just taking footwork for me instead of getting me lightheaded blowing it up so let's go ahead and inflate this bad boy all right guys so i've got it inflated here it's not super quick but it's not that bad i mean you what i kind of figured out is you kind of want to use your heel because the heel kind of makes a nice seal on that pump uh valve right there and then once you're done like i think this is pretty well full you just put this rubber gasket back in there and then screw down this top and I guess maybe this is the top. 
Although you could probably use this end and it's probably, this is probably the top right. It looks good and in fact it says Intex is, is upright in that way. So you kind of have this little microfiber um, and then you can see the, uh, you know, the pump right there. But that's the key. Uh, it, I'll tell you, when you're pumping it, it doesn't feel like you're pumping a lot of air at first. But then it does fill up pretty quickly once you get to the end. So I'm pretty impressed with this thing. Like I said, you know, a twin size mattress, they're very handy. Camping, sitting around outside, uh, additional bedding for your guests. Uh, but the the best thing about this bad boy is that you don't need to bust out another pump. If you're busting out this this air mattress, it has everything you need in it uh, without having to go dig for other hardware. So I love that. I definitely think it's worthwhile. Now, how is it? Is it comfortable? Oh man, I could sleep on this. Yeah, and I'm a I'm a big dude, so uh, this is this is no problem. And I might just take a nap on it. Intex built-in pump and this air mattress. I'll put a link to it in the description. Peter Von Panda. Out! Ah. <sighs>